Hello, Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out who has been obsessively thinking about you lately. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me for Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Who has been obsessively thinking about Earth Signs lately? Four of Pentacles. Ace of Swords. Ooh. Empress. Nine of Pentacles. The World. There's one extra one right here. Okay. Bottom of the deck is the Ten of Cups. So this is definitely you with the Nine of Pentacles here. Earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. And this person most likely is a water sign with a page of cups here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Have I already said that? <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, it's a water sign, okay? Can be any fixed signs here as well with the world. Could be an Aquarius. Maybe this person could also be an earth sign like you are, okay? Can be any sign. But I feel like with the four of pentacles here, this person is thinking heavily in regards of how. Look, there's four pentacles and there's nine here. For some reason, I feel like you, have, you are the nine, right? So this person may be a four. Could be in whatever level. Could be because maybe you're making more money than them or you look you're better looking than them or that you're more popular than them or you're more successful uh, than them you have your life much more together than this person okay and the empress here is in reverse and the star is in reverse hmm. i feel like again earth signs i don't know why i keep getting the mother energy here for some of you um it could be your mother thinking about you but because we've also, we've, we've also got the ten of cups here so could be a family member okay i feel like most likely it's a mom i don't know why earth signs you may have your mom missing you thinking a lot about you holding you very tightly keeping you very close to their heart Maybe your mom with the star here in reverse. This is very specific. It's not for all of you, okay? Star in reverse, maybe they're, they've been sick. They're recovering from their sickness. That's just for some of you. Again, that's very, very um, specific, all right? But for a lot of your signs, maybe this person is holding on to you. Whom could be obsessively thinking about. Maybe you were the empress here in reverse, right? From the empress in reverse to the nine of pentacles in an upright. That means the nine of pentacles is more of a single energy. While the empress in reverse is more like a taken energy. Uh, someone whom is taken, married, or has a significant other. Because she is perpetual perpetually pregnant right with the empress here and the star here is in, in reverse can indicate maybe in the past some of you maybe this person you were married to in the past may not always mean that but it could also just mean that you nurtured this person a lot you cared for this person a lot at one point in time but you no longer do and the star here in reverse can indicate maybe both of you are not really um, on good terms so this person is obsessively thinking about how maybe you are doing better than them. Nine of Pentacles here and the Ace of Swords. Can indicate maybe you have cut this person off, okay? Hmm. But for some of you are signs, if this is kind of like a new energy, two different scenarios here. Again, just take what resonates with you. If there is someone new in your life, I'm saying new every time when I see an ace, that means there's a chance for this person to be a new person, but could also be a past person. Um, but I feel like if this is a new person uh, or signs, this person is realizing with ace of swords here, they are very clear as as in who you are or what you expect. So now Pentacles is somebody who has high standards, right? And maybe they feel inferior of you. Maybe. I feel like this person may have some fear, inferi inferiority complex. <laughs> Sorry, I can't say that word. 
tongue twister, but um, I feel like with the Seven of Cups here and my verse, you know, the stars somehow, maybe this person thinks like you're better than them again. Maybe you're uh, completely out of their league because they are just four and then you're nine, okay? You could be, again, better looking or more successful or you have high standards. This person may not. <laughs> it feels like they either have low self-esteem or they, they feel inferior because you you're better than them in some way, shape, or form, okay? But I feel like they, they could be thinking obsessively in regards of why would you choose them? Why would you choose to talk to them, right? You see, Seven of Cups here is in my verse. You have a lot of options. Why are you choosing them? That's what they're, they're thinking about. <laughs> like, why? Because Earth Science is a nine. Nine is almost perfect, it's almost ten and... I don't give anybody a 10 because that's impossible. I feel like human beings are, none of us, none of us are perfect. So, but three of swords here is in reverse, page of cups in reverse, and the world is in an upright position. Either this person is younger than you are or that they are less established than you are. And then the world here can decay. Maybe this person lives far away from you or that they love to travel or that they could be obsessively thinking how you have everything. They may be thinking about everything, right? The world, like, just going round and round in circles, thinking excessively in regards of how you can have anything, anyone, and you look great, you are attractive. Um, and then why? <laughs> That's what they're thinking about. Like, why are you choosing? Why are you choosing them? They are just a page, right? And the Three of Swords here in my verse, like, I feel like, This is a delayed heartbreak, so they may be fearful in regards to if you're going to break their heart, okay? And this person may be obsessively thinking about how you may eventually maybe cut them off, or maybe you one day are going to realize that they are less than you, or that they, you know, that you could do better, and that they might, and that you might hurt them with a the three of swords here in my verse. Because this person sees your value, your worth, but they don't see their own worth and value. <laughs> like, they're making some comparisons for sure. <clears throat> Again, some of the cups here in my verse just feels like they wonder why you choose them. Because you can have anything, anyone you want, because you're so gorgeous. The Nine of Pentacles, it's a very gorgeous energy and the world, of course, you know. Look at this, what do you call this thing here, wrapped around her. It's just, it's a very feminine energy. So for a lot of you earth signs, you could be, um, at least I would say, 80% of you are female watching this, okay. And Seven of Wands here is in my verse, Ten of Cups. They're also obsessively thinking about the future with you. Because the Ten of Cups indicates some sort of a future. Um, but Cups are not, you know, Cups are not pentacles. So it hasn't become a reality yet. But this person is obsessed with thinking about a future. Will both of you have a future together? Uh, will you see Will you see them being in, the, in your future? Yeah. And Five of Swords is right here, and we've got the Seven of Wands in my first. It feels like this person could also be obsessively thinking like how they need to be very careful. The Five of Swords, if they want you, they have to plan something in regards to their future, um, so that it's so that both so that it's possible for both of you to be together. Okay, especially if this is someone whom is still working and trying to build something for themselves financially, career-wise, or if this person, you know, is at a distance from you are, okay? There's some blockages here as signs. Um, I feel like they're afraid. They're afraid you're going to hurt them one day. But they have, like, hope. I, I would say they will have, they have hope that things will change because the world can indicate a new beginning. And then maybe Ten of Cups here, both of you will be able to um, s live together, be with each other happily ever after. Ten of Cups, right? Hmm. 
they're planning, they're planning something. But right now, they may be keeping to themselves for pentacles in regards to their plan. It feels like, again, that this person could be obsess obsessively thinking about how you are. You're way more established than they are. Yeah, that's definitely the main message here, Earth signs. Unless this is someone you are separated from, if that's the case, Earth signs, this person may be thinking obsessively in regards of, you know, talking, making, you know, clarifying something to you, and perhaps with three swords here out first, you know, heal this connection. Um, maybe they could be thinking about how they need to put their guards down or that they could be waiting for you to put your guards down before they speak with you, right? They could also be thinking about how you might just not accept their offer, not accept their apology here, and that you're doing all right on your own and that you don't, you don't need them. But there is a hope for a reconciliation. The star here in reverse indicates an... Someone may be unable to forgive. They may be thinking heavily or obsessively in regards of forgiveness, whether it's from you or from them. And seven of cups here in reverse, the world. They could be thinking maybe you're done, right? Maybe you have closed out the chapter with them and then you are starting a new chapter on your own. The world also can indicate them mm, thinking obsessively in regards of how they need to at least show to you that they are done and that would be a good strategy with the five of swords here because five of swords can indicate a certain deception or them planning to you know one up you this could be someone you're separated from okay if that's uh, your scenario but anyway earth signs virgo taurus capricorn is your reading hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now first one is from my second channel it's a travel vlog channel check it out if you want to and the second playlist is from this channel has all of the readings that i've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics different questions but these readings are still relevant because i post them almost every single day take care of signs hope to see you back here again tomorrow bye